Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is India Alexis. Welcome back to another video. I create lifestyle content, travel vlogs, fashion content here and there because I'm a shopaholic and honestly just a little bit of everything as I journey through young adulthood. So welcome to my channel. Today I'm bringing you guys a fall collective haul. If you've been following me on Instagram and TikTok, I have been in my outfit inspiration bag this year like I actually just finished the 14 days of fall fits on my Instagram and TikTok. I'm gonna insert a compilation of all the outfits right here and I honestly just wanted it to be like inspiration for the girls for what we can wear now that it's getting colder and and honestly it was a challenge for myself um, to style things that I have picked up over the past couple of months or that I already own. I'm so excited to show you guys what I picked up over the past couple of months and also how you can style it because what is a haul without seeing how it looks on me and how I would wear it, you know? Before we actually get into the haul, I wanted to touch on what I've been using to like actually spice up my outfits. If you can't tell. <laughs> and that's jewelry. Without jewelry and accessories, your outfits are boring and they really just like don't come together so I'm so excited when Ana Luisa reached out to me to send me over some pieces that I could feature in today's video. Something that I've really been into in the past couple of months is mixing metal so wearing silver and gold together. Honestly can't ever choose what I want to wear what looks better with an outfit so I just wear both. <laughs> So the mixed metal pieces I have on today are from Ana Luisa. I love Ana Luisa jewelry because they are, one, they're very long lasting. I've had this bracelet from Ana Luisa for a couple of years now and I love to mix my silver watch, the gold band, and then just like a rhinestone bracelet and I think it just looks like very sophisticated together. And then the pieces that I have on, which is this herringbone chain and these mixed metal earrings are also from Ana Luisa as well. I love Ana Luisa jewelry for a variety of reasons because one, I can wear it in the shower. It's water resistant, it's hypoallergenic, and then they also have a two year warranty on their jewelry. So if anything was to happen to it, you can send it back and get it replaced for free. So I'm gonna have the link to the Ana Luisa jewelry that I have on and also just a link to the Ana Luisa site in the description box below where you can get up to 25% off of all pieces on Ana Luisa's sites. So yes, thank you so much Ana Luisa for sponsoring this portion of today's video and let's get into the haul. Okay, so I'm gonna break this video up into four separate categories. I have shoes, a bag, jackets, and jeans. So if you're interested in one specific portion of the video, just hop into that. I'm gonna have the timestamps in the description. But the first category is jackets, because this is my most recent pick and the thing I'm most excited to show you guys. It is this jacket right here from Nordstrom. It is from the Topshop brand, and if you are a shopaholic like me, you know that Topshop is not only available at Nordstrom, but it's also available on ASOS. I was able to find the jacket on both sites. I'm gonna insert the try-on portion on this side so you can see what actually the jacket looks like on me but this is just a beautiful like green leather bomber jacket it's showing up a little darker on the camera but in person it's like this beautiful like matcha green color the jacket is so warm it's so like nicely oversized but then it also fits perfectly on the body. I love the jacket as well because it has like the banding at the bottom so it's not just like looking frumpy on you. You can like scrunch it up on your waist to give you some sort of shape when you put it on. I paired this jacket with just a white turtleneck, jeans, and some adidas. I feel like the jacket was just the statement that made the outfit pop. I'm gonna link each outfit that I wear in the description box below on my LTK so you can shop the outfit. So if you like the jacket that I'm wearing, if you like the jeans that I'm wearing that I don't even show you, you can check the jeans out, you know. Find whatever it is on the outfit that you like in my LTK. But yes, I am so obsessed with this jacket. Um, it retails for about $110, so it was a little bit of a splurge for me. But I'm going to get a bunch of wear out of this jacket. So definitely will get my cost per wear out of this jacket, for sure, for sure. All right, the next jacket I have here is from Zara. If you haven't been living under a rock, um, you probably have seen this jacket year after year after year after year. And every year I'm just like, I don't need to buy, I don't need to spend $100 on a jacket. Like, I really just don't need this jacket. But I wanted this jacket for such a long time. It is just a Sherpa, what is it, Sherpa, like Borg aviator style jacket. 
So I got this jacket here from Zara in a size small. Honestly, this is just gonna be a staple coat in my wardrobe this fall and winter season. It doesn't get too cold here in Charlotte, so I don't necessarily need a winter coat, um, but this is a jacket that I'm just gonna wear all the time in the fall. Right here, there's not too much I can say about it because everybody and their mother has this jacket, but I have just wanted it for such a long time. This is the year that I just bit the bullet. I purchased it. Um, when I was back home in New York last month um, at the Zara in Soho. So, yes. All right, so on to the next category. The next category is bags. But I only got one bag to show you, and it is this beautiful. Prepare your heart, mind, and soul for this beautiful bag. I went to the Coach Outlet because I love Coach, but Coach is expensive, so I really only shop the Coach Outlet. I went to the Coach Outlet in August and I found this beautiful red bag right here. Honestly, <laughs> this bag is absolutely gorgeous. Um, red is so in season for the fall. Honestly, it would look really nice with this cardigan. Honestly, red is just that like pop of color to bring your outfits to the next level, whether it's you're wearing gray, whether you're wearing black. Sometimes you can pair it with like, um, with like tans and beiges to make your outfit pop. Bag right here from the Coach Outlet. I believe it's called the Carmen Crinkle Patent Leather Bag. I'm gonna have the exact link in the description box below. But this bag came in red, it came in black, and I think it came in tan as well. I really like this bag because you can wear it um, two ways. You can either wear it like crossbody, as you see here. I'll insert what it looks like on my body crossbody here. Or you can just wear it as like a top handle bag and just hold it like this. Um, the bag is super spacious, super, super spacious inside. It fits my phone, wallet, keys, lip gloss, and that's really all I need. And I've wore this bag a couple of times already, so really excited to continue to style this like beautiful statement bag for the fall. Alrighty, so the next category of things are jeans. So I have been approaching my jean game differently lately. So um, as I've gotten older, I've been straying away from like very tight fitting jeans. I love baggy jeans or just like very loose fitting jeans because they're just more comfortable. Um, I don't really feel like struggling and being uncomfortable in my clothes these days. So <laughs> what I've been doing is I've been purchasing jeans maybe one or two sizes higher and then just getting it taken in at the tailor for my waist. So it still gives you that like baggy feeling but it fits my waist perfectly so I absolutely love that. So the first pair of pants I actually did that with are these jeans right here from Zara. They're just these gray straight leg jeans. Um, they're high waisted so I really like that. They're high waisted so I really like that and I've been gravitating away from like blue jeans and either going for like gray or tan or black uh, for the fall time. So yes, got these jeans right here. For reference, I am 5'6", five, 5'7", five, on a good day, my legs are really long um, and these jeans go all the way down to the ground for me. So. And they're just like very comfortable and very flattering. They go with like a variety of different things. So I love them. So the next pair of jeans actually is my second favorite purchase that I've made in the past couple of months. I don't know, stuck with that green jacket at the beginning and then these tiger print jeans from Jaded London. The next pair of jeans I wanted to show you are these beautiful bootleg tiger jeans from Jaded London, right there. Um, this is what the jeans look like. I have always been a fan of Jaded London clothes, however they are very expensive. So there's things that I like eye for some time and then I'm like, oh, should I get it, should I not? But I am so glad that I purchased these jeans, again, in a size in a size higher, so a size 28, and then got them taken in at the waist because they fit absolutely perfectly on me. And they hit the ground even when I was wearing heels the other day. It just looks so good. Leopard print tiger print, zebra print, as you see I'm wearing all these prints right now, are just like very in. I paired it with just a off the shoulder tan shirt and then these beautiful green heels that I had from Shein in this green bag. It just like came all together. I just felt so beautiful. Print is just very neutral so you can do a variety of different things with these jeans. So love them. All right, it's so the last category. This one by fast. <laughs> so the last category of things that I have are shoes. Um, so I have one pair of sneakers and one pair of boots to show you guys. Adidas has actually been 
slaughtering like really killing <laughs> the sneaker game this entire year whether it's like sambas or giselle so like samba collaborations i purchased a pair of sambas at the beginning of the year with like the platform on it that i wear all the time so i wanted to get a more neutral pair of um adidas so i got these adidas right here they are a brown color i am absolutely obsessed <laughs> i am absolutely obsessed with these sneakers i haven't worn them just yet because i haven't found like the perfect outfit that i wanted to wear with yet but like a neutral like greens and olives and tans and browns and chocolate would like look really nice with these sneakers so i definitely will get a lot of wear out of them so these are the adidas let me see if the tag is still in here the adidas handball special um i think these are giselle's i don't think they're um they're sambas um but i will have the exact name in the description box below i'm not a sneakerhead i'm not a sneakerhead so don't come for me like <laughs> I just know what I like and I like these shoes so yes they're right here they were sold out for a long time on ASOS and I was just like watching them until they came back in stock I wear size 9 so they look a little big but <laughs> regardless they're still super super cute and I can't wait to style them and the last item I have here are something I am so excited to style. I've already been trying on like different outfits I can wear these boots with. I've never had a pair of cowboy boots. Burgundy is actually my favorite color. So when I saw these boots at Zara, I didn't even care that they were cowboy boots. I was like, I just need these boots because they're beautiful. So, so it's these beautiful pair of burgundy and black cowboy boots if you look up closely you can see that it doesn't look just like brown it's like black and burgundy like a gradient effect of burgundy on the heel i want to wear these boots with like a gray skirt and then like a black sweater i think that would look really nice like gray jean skirt or because it's still kind of warm here in charlotte during the day but then it gets night cold at night i could wear these boots with like shorts or shorts and a sweater and I think that would look really cute too. I'm just really excited to style these boots that I got from Zara. Everything that I got here is a statement piece because I've really been on the mission to find my personal style and try things outside my comfort zone this year and I've been doing that. <laughs> and I've been doing that with like unique pieces that I found from a variety of different stores so yes that is everything in my collective haul so yes that is everything that i have purchased in the past couple of months and how i style them as well again i will have my anna luisa link in the description box below if you want to shop any of this mixed metal goodness that i have on and then i also will have every single outfit and item that i showed today in the video linked in my ltk and hopefully this video serves as inspiration to you to try things outside of your comfort zone elevate your personal style and just put it on honestly <laughs> and honestly just put it on so yes thank you so much for watching and i will catch you guys in my next one bye